always can find a way to get to your class on time. Just have to stay calm. Something you're gonna love, love, is the amount of spirit here, okay? Our pep assemblies are awesome. If I could talk to my freshman self right now, I would probably be saying, don't be afraid to try something new. There's tons of things at this high school that people don't even know about that are very interesting or very fun to do, that if you just try it, you're gonna get rewards or you're gonna find, hey, maybe I don't like that, and you're gonna find things that you like to do and develop yourself more. Hey, my name's Kale Santini, and I'll be your guide today on the tour of everything our wonderful high school has to offer. So for the next couple of minutes, sit back, relax, and let information about our classes, sports, extracurriculars, and even graduation, it does end eventually, wash over you. Some people consider this building big, scary, and easy to get lost in. Unless you're trying to get around using these maps, it really isn't. Not to mention all of the kind, courteous, and helpful people inside that will help you find your way. But for now, let's get orientated. Here's that familiar view of the high school from Mitchell. Over here is the south parking lot. Buses will pick you up and drop you off right here. And this is the north parking lot, used primarily for staff and student parking. Here is another common view of the north entrance. While we're here, notice that there are three floors at south. In some areas, the first floor appears hidden, which confuses some people in regards to which floor they're on. So there you go. Not as intimidating as before, huh? And if you ever do manage to get lost, you can just ask any friendly face you see. After a couple of days, you'll have this place down like the back of your hand. Now that you feel a little bit more acquainted with South, let's get down to the nitty gritty. Our education. And let's be honest, it's the real reason we're all in school. To pass classes and get that sweet certificate, our diploma. There is graduation and the awarding of diplomas. And it's not just about the certificate. Your diploma symbolizes a commitment to being the best person you can be. Your commitment is evidenced by the diverse range of classes you've taken. Sure, you have your core classes, but the other classes will assist you in becoming specialized in your future career. So have a quick look at the classes in your future. South also has several special service programs available to all grades and skill levels. In the guidance office, there are six counselors to help you with your academic planning in addition to personal issues. Two counselors, as well as a dean and a vice principal, will follow you throughout your tenure at South Kitsap. And here we have the Career Center. Inside, our career counselor will assist you with and answer every question you possibly have about either the college scholarship process or any other post high school plan you may have. Additionally, begin to think of your career as it relates to these pathways. Once you've figured that out, you can search for classes that advance your knowledge within your pathway. This includes the classes you're taking now and the grades you've already earned. Even though you're a freshman, you're still a wolf. 
Once you begin to think in terms of these pathways, you can genuinely begin to understand what you'd like to do, whether it's engineering, teaching, childcare, or journalism. South has courses for you. Don't waste the opportunity to take AP, college in the high school, or tech prep classes because they can save you hundreds of dollars compared to taking them at your local college. Now it may seem that high schools all work and no play, but nothing could be further from the truth, my wolf. South has tons of extracurricular activities. Now before I go on, I just want to say, all that trailblazer, rain devil general stuff? Leave that behind in junior high school. We have foes like the lions, cougars, and tides to worry about. All you young wolves may be asking yourself, how can I stand out? How can I make this den my own? Or, how can I manage to earn my diploma, but still have fun doing it? The answer, my dear young wolves, is to get involved. You'll hear that more than once in your time at South, but only because it's so true. You'll only get out of high school what you put into it. You don't have to run for office or join every club, just find something you care about and the rest will come naturally. So there you go, Young Wolves. You've heard the secret to success. It's up to you to apply it and live it. Do so, and we promise you won't regret anything as you're walking across the stage, diploma in hand. But for now, it's time to focus on entering the den and becoming a member of the pack. I know as a freshman, coming up to the high school was a huge change that was gonna happen in my life, but well, just with like meeting new people, being surrounded by a whole new atmosphere and being with the juniors and seniors and everything, but it was, it was a good change. It wasn't a bad change. You meet new people, you get new friends, you experience new things such as clubs and sports, and it's definitely a good change that's going to happen, not a bad thing. Just relax, okay? Clear your head, walk into school, you're going to see everyone you saw from junior high. Don't worry about it, and you're going to love it. High school seems hard, but once you get out in the real world, it gets a lot tougher. So really put in your best effort and make friends, get involved, because once I started getting involved, I've had the most fun I've ever had. So it's important to do that. Thanks for watching. We hope you're excited about coming to the high school, because it really is an amazing place. But just to remind you, South can only offer you the opportunity to succeed. It's up to you to take advantage of it. Well, that's it, Wolves. We look forward to seeing you around.